Hello my gorgeous friends on the internet, it's your boy Weba Naimane and in today's video I will cover how to find winning print on demand designs. Now the success of your print on demand store depends on your designs because print on demand revolves around designs. Now if you're not familiar with the term print on demand, print on demand is a business model that involves making our designs and putting them on products such as t-shirts, hoodies, stickers, coffee mugs, sweatshirts, stickers. Whenever a customer orders this product, the art gets printed on that product. Whenever a customer orders an art on a product, the art gets printed on that particular product and is shipped to that customer. You as the seller, you don't need to touch the product, you don't need to see it, you don't even need to deal with customers in some cases. So, how do you go about finding winning designs for your print on demand store? Now, if you are new to my channel, I publish monthly income report and you've seen that I make at least an upward of $500 monthly from my print on demand stores. and. How am I able to do this is because I'm able to find winning print on demand designs before anyone else and in this video that is what I'm going to show you. I'll show you one method to find winning print on demand designs before it gets saturated. Now this method involves going to this secret website called topbubbleindex.com. Visit topbubbleindex.com and when it opens you, you see there is a catalog of tools for print on demand business now as you see here there's a there are red bubble tools etsy tools design tools and others now i've made a video in the past where i showed you how to use this design editor to automate your print on demand designs if you want to find that i encourage you to check my youtube channel also subscribe for more so that you get more videos when i release them but today we are not doing with the design editor tool today we'll be doing with some other tool called the red bubble um trending keywords to red bubble trending keywords to red bubble trending keywords to now once you click that tool you get to see in alphabetical order the top 75 designs that are trending at the moment on Redbubble. Now if you are not familiar with what Redbubble is, Redbubble is a print on demand e-commerce website where artists put their ad designs and whenever this design sells on Redbubble's products, Redbubble does the shipping, they do the printing, they do the packaging and they do the shipping to the customer. Now for you to sell for your designs to sell on redbubble they have to be designs that customers are actively searching on the marketplace and what this website does this top bubble index website does is that it shows you the list of the top 75 trending keywords at the moment updated daily of products of designs of keywords being searched by customers on the redbubble algorithm now whilst this is trending keywords on redbubble it is encouraged that you also put these designs on other platforms especially platforms like t public that is not very saturated you will stand chances of get letting getting your designs to sell now this is the secret i've been able to use to make over 300 dollars in just one month alone on my t public store now as you see on my red bubble store all time i've been able to make 796 dollars and on my t public store i've been able to make 319 dollars in just one month my an all time of two thousand dollars now back to the video now as you see over here these are the list of daily trading designs you can come and see the designs that are selling for the best selling for the week the best selling designs for the week you can see them here valentine's day andrew Garfield, 
and lip stickers now these are the top 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 best selling designs for the week now you can sort this by you can sort it yeah you can keep on going to see designs that are best selling for the week and for the month you can also see the best trending relevant keywords the best selling the best selling keywords for that particular month you can see 90s movie stickers a car sticker a2 music stickers you can go on to make these designs and post them on your red bubble store and you get sales hopefully put them daily daily this site is updated daily so it's encouraged that you come and check this site daily and make designs daily now one thing i like to do whenever i come to this site is i sort the designs by results so it comes in alphabetical orders they add the um, designs with the lists with the list number of listings on redbubble site come first and from there you know the designs to make and one cool thing about this website is you can easily see the number one seller for each trending keyword the number one design for each trending keyword for each trending keyword like this you pose we expose yeah this is it and i was just making a design for this um listed recently you post we expose is a design for radiologists for those who study radiology so this is one tool you can use to find hot hot selling designs winning designs for your print on demand store and i guarantee if you do this daily and you upload designs daily in less than no time you start seeing sales sales now this is just one way of doing keyword research for your print on demand store if you would like to find out the other methods i encourage you to hit the subscribe button also hit the like button and comment what video you want me to make next i'll be publishing a course very soon and in that course i will review all my secrets to how i make trading designs how i'm able to generate a lot of sales selling print on demand items alone on platforms like etsy on t public and redbubble now before i summarize i also want to mention that there is also an etsy trending keywords to write on this website and what this does is that it shows you the number it shows you the keywords that are currently trending on etsy platform but one reason why i don't go with this is that it's always saturated etsy is a much bigger platform than redbubble and tip of the so there will be a lot of competition so i basically stick to the redbubble trending keywords too but all the same you can also come here to get ideas of what we say what is selling like as you see two 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 shirts you can see that 20k savings challenge 20k savings challenge see this is a very good keyword and um, what okay 20k seven seven in these two thousand favorites a hundred and two over a hundred and twenty thousand views average price one dollar competition uh, this has a very low competition very low competition so that might be a very interesting keyword to check out for to make designs for competing shops just to see stores so how if you want to use this etsy keyword research too i encourage you just stick your eyes to this competition and competing shops column like this keyword is a very interesting keyword it has a hundred over 120,000 views with just 61 shops competing for um, just 61 um competition and um 36 jobs competing for it so one thing you can do is um you can easily just sort yeah sort it by competition and so on and so forth you can also sort by competing shops 
but what that does is you know any most keywords that have lower competing shops they actually have low views but i'm getting to see some interesting keywords here like this particular keyword let me see let me search google for this okay this is an artist creator okay this might be a trademark because this person is an artist so he has 5998 views only three shops competing for that keyword spider-man nike sweatshirt embroidered 312 views with only three shops competing wow olivia bottega ah. i'm guessing this should be a brand or something yeah it's a brand so basically you can also come here to do your keyword research track my other status no i don't want to check that okay wow encanto camille now you have to be careful because this is disney most of these items that have a lot of favorites and a lot of views with less competing shops might be trademarked so you have to be careful you have to be careful but all in all this is a very good tool to do your keyword research you can use the um trending keywords to on redbubble or that of etsy if you prefer basically i stick to that of redbubble and i made a video of this design editor on how to use it to automate your designs upload to check that video out and i I guarantee you will like the video so if this video is something you like leave a comment section telling me i like this video also let me know what video you'll be expecting me to make next hit the like button and also hit the subscribe button for me to make more videos like this peace and god bless